Hello everyone and welcome back to another Let's Play. Today we are playing a new release, well a technically a remake, remaster? Remake of an older game, <clears throat> two older games. One was released in the United States and the other one wasn't. Um, we're playing another code recollection. Um, from what I know about it, you're a young girl going to visit um, an island in search of her father, I think? We saw like a little preview of a note, a letter sent to her, um, before this screen happened. I'm really curious to see what the story's about. It looks really nice, um, and I'm ready to solve some puzzles from the beginning. What are our options? Autoplay? So we can like turn um, puzzle hints off. I think I will leave that like that for now. And if we ever need help, we'll turn that on. But yeah, let's just jump right in. It looks very nice, very um, pretty. I love the art style. So let's go from the beginning. On my way. <clears throat> Blood Edward Island, 1948. Oh my God. Thomas, why? Father? <laughs> hey, yo, whoa, whoa, whoa! A murder mystery? Oh, Seattle suburbs, 1994. That was a long time ago. Hurry, Ashley, hide. What? What do you hope to accomplish? Mommy? Bro, not here too, hello? Two memories. Blood Edward Island, 2005. <laughs> if I, if fo I follow oh. this path, she's speaking. I can get to the mansion. <sighs> Watch out! What? Bro, <gasps> oh, a rock slide? going back now what should I do I guess we're gonna continue forward girl that's a big ass landslide wait I thought we started on a boat maybe we don't this feature indicates your destination and places a compass around Ashley that points towards it you can turn the navigation feature on or off by pressing L ah uh, let's okay this feature shows puzzles Puzzle hints. Enabling this will make puzzles easier. Show hints by pressing um, 
the minus button, when a question mark appears, you can turn the hint feature on and off from the options screen. Do I have them on? I don't. Just some nice accessibility. We'll try to figure things out on our own. I kind of want that to be faster. It feels really slow. Uh-oh. We can't even go forward. The rocks <sighs> block this too. Mansion rear entrance. Mm. Oh, this is so cute. What the heck? I was right. The path leads to the mansion. Well, not anymore. hear water nearby. I wonder hmm. where this river is flowing from. Maybe over mm. there? Why did there- why was there a rock slide, bro? What's That's that? Uh... While pressing ZR, use- Ah! Okay, which one's ZR? Aha! I figured it out. We're playing on the Switch. This released on the Switch. Oh. Ah! Oh. This is the way to the mansion. Is that a gravestone? What? Mm. I need to cross this bridge to continue on the path. But how can I get across? Call hell if I know. Is there a way to make the... Let me also bump up the vertical just in case. Alright, that feels a little better. We probably might bump it up a little more. Uh -uh. Oh, there's no point in going back? Okay, well, I was trying to find a... something to cross with. Oh, right here. Long board. There's a long board. Hmm. Maybe I can use this board. Got a long board! Puzzles, dude. Hmm. Oh, we can click Y. Oh, that's our DAS. A mysterious device I received in the mail. The buttons make it look like a game console. Let's investigate this, actually. Hang on. It does look like a game console. Is it a camera? This can't be used here. Okay. Alright, yeah. this I can. Oh, this is really cute. They showed this in the preview of the game, so I kind of already knew where to put it. That's totally stable. All right, now I can get across. <laughs> I love this little uh style. Careful. Huh? You're probably really light, so it's probably fine. What's this? Yeah, what is this? Only Edward family members permitted to pass this point. Edward? The captain mentioned that name. What? See, if you didn't watch the trailer, you wouldn't have known anything about no captain. Unless we're about to go back to the captain. Chapter 1, meet with D. Few hours earlier, we're about to meet the captain. Off the coast of Seattle, February 24th, 2005. Aww. Do 
show me your pe sad past. <laughs> Didn't you just kill her mom? Bro, is this the same scene? Dad. Hey. What's up? Look alive. We're almost there. This looks so pretty. I love the art style. So that's Blood Edward Island? Right you are, miss. That's our destination. Used to get more than two visitors at once. Not much call for a ferryman there now. <clears throat> he said two visitors? Anyway, your business is your own, of course. But I'm sure curious what calls you out here. The day before my 14th birthday started off pretty bad. On the boat, the waters were calm. But inside, I felt tossed in a storm. There's someone else! I was so excited. But also lost and angry. I've never felt so torn apart. Who could blame me? I mean, my dad. I always thought he was dead. But he's alive! Bro, he might have killed your mom. <laughs> is what I'm putting together. There is someone else on board, too. This lady. Or, I think it's a lady. Well, where'd she go? Oh, she's on that side. It's a very small boat. Look at him, he looks so cool. With his snapback. Wow, the water, this is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Dad. Dad is on that island, is he? Okay. Hello, Jessica. Jessica, hey. Oh, good. You're awake. I think I'll just enable autoplay for this kind of stuff because they're, if they're going to speak it themselves, I think it should go at a reasonable pace, yeah? Come feel the breeze. It's nice. Who's Jessica? Yeah, nice. What's wrong? Feeling seasick? Nah, I'm alright. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Let me guess. You had the dream again? Yeah. I don't know why I keep having it. It always ends the same. And no matter how hard I try, I can't remember Dad's face. Don't rack your brain too hard. You were so little back then. Besides, you'll see him in person soon. Is this like our guardian? So cheer up. I guess. Jessica is dad's little sister. Oh. She's all the family I have left. She's raised me since I was little. And on a high school chem teacher's salary. Don't get me wrong, she's been really nice. She always considers what's best for me and helps me out when I need it. That's good. Now, though, I don't know. Why did you never tell me Dad was alive? 
Why have you been lying oh. to me all this time? Yeah, right? Like, wouldn't you know? That's... I mean... I promised your dad. Oh, that's... Okay, promised cool. Promised him what? It was 11 years ago. Richard showed up one day, holding you. He just turned three. It was so sudden, I could tell something was wrong. He said, look after her. I'll be back for her someday. Oh, someday? But until you hear from me again, it's best if you tell her I'm dead. Bro, what the fuck? Why would he say that? He didn't tell me. I bet he wanted nothing to do with me after mom died. No, it wasn't like that. Oh. My brother's a good man. Please trust that he had his reasons. He's not the kind of man who'd abandon his child if there was any other option. I remember the warmth in his eyes as he looked at you. <sighs> when I saw that, I knew I had to take care of you until he came back home. I'm so sorry, Ashley. I wanted to tell you sooner. Crazy. Maybe he wasn't the one. I received a package a few days ago. It didn't say who it was from. But there were two things inside. A letter from Dad, who I thought died when I was three. And this strange device that looks like a game system. Now here I am, rereading the letter on a boat with my aunt, heading to Blood Edward Island, where my dad is supposed to be waiting. Okay. So, what was he like? My dad? Well, Richard is a brilliant neuroscientist. Neuroscientist? He was, is a neuroscientist? Like, he studied brains? Yeah, and I bet he made that device he sent you. The DOS. Device! Really? He made this? Oh, that's cool, the reflection! Okay, that's kind of amazing. What exactly did he study? His focus was on memory. Memory. Huh. He worked for a leading neuroscience research center. Talented scientists from all over the world came together there. He met a scientist from Japan, and they fell in love. Before long, they got married. You're talking about... Right. Sayoko mom she was your mother oh mother can you tell me more about mom Sayoko had a powerful mind and an equally powerful will she had beautiful eyes too and that's where you get yours. They look just like hers. That's not what I mean. I want to hear real stuff. Like what? Just tell me the truth about her. The truth? Whatever it is, I can handle it. And I won't be mad. I just want to know about mom. She also got- <sighs> she also died. She was murdered. I always thought mom died along with dad. Since it turns out dad's alive, that means mom is too. Nope. Right? Nope. Is she on the island with him? Y you can tell me. Ashley, that's something you'll have to ask Richard about. What? Uh. He'll get all the answers you're looking for when you meet him. Great. Thanks. Why are you keeping her in the dark? I guess she's 14, but hello, just say her mom died. Like, legitly, we definitely saw her got, get shot, right? Like, that was, like, legit a thing that happened. All right, what's this device? What does it do? So, 
Dad sent me this. It says D A S. Das? What do you think that stands for? Dunno. What's this camera icon? We can take photos! You can take pictures using the DAS. DAS camera or ZL. You can see the pictures in the DAS emblem. Emblem. Bam! Oh. Huh. It works. <laughs> now how do I look at the picture I took? Not bad. Could you take one of me next? Sorry, but no. You're the only one who can use that thing. What do you mean? What? Why? Like DNA? I had spent some time fiddling with it after it arrived. Seems like it's keyed to your genetic data using biometrics. Biometrics. Now we get to ask about biometrics. Tell me about it. I want all the knowledge. Biometrics? Biometric systems read a person's unique attributes. They can use those unique identifiers as a sort of key. Your DAS seems to have a system like that built in. Meaning it won't work for anyone but you. Huh. So, it'll only work for me. Sorry to interrupt, but we're almost there. And then somehow we got- we were by ourselves, on the way to the mansion with an avil- or a rock slide. Who knows what happened to our aunt? <laughs> Guess we'll find out. Mysterious man, are you my father? Well, that's dangerous. Don't do that. My album, my album. I was moving. I thought I was zooming. I only get 10 pictures. You look so sad. Don't look so sad. Why do we only get 10 pictures? That's kind of sucky. What is it? I don't know, Captain. I'm just. Where could a Richard be? He was looking at us ominously, I think. Piled up wooden boxes. Old wooden crates that looked ready to fall apart or stacked without any rhyme or reason. Oh, I read it too fast and I was trying to skip it, but it wouldn't let me. up he's not here wasn't someone supposed to meet you here yeah strange I wonder if something came up Richard should be here I changed my mind I'm not going Ashley why isn't dad here He's the one who told me to come to this island. So where is he? Was he though? What? Is he too busy? I bet he doesn't want to see me after all. <sighs> Excuse me? No offense, but I have other passengers today. Damn. I'm going back to the mainland in a bit, if that's all right with you. Yes, that's fine. Well then, I'll be back by evening to pick you up as planned. Got it. Thank you. Why 
Don't you wait here. I'll go find your father. And then where did Jessica go? I mean, this isn't like an actual place where people live, is it still? I'll be right back. She'll be right back. I don't think we're gonna stay put. I think we're gonna keep going. Oh no, she stayed put, okay. Your mom looked worried. Oh, that's not our mom. Jessica's not my mom. What is she then? Your sister? Aunt. No, Jessica's my aunt. She raised me. My dad bailed. Left me with her. I thought he was dead until I got this letter. Hold on now. What? Uh, it's clear you're working through some things right now. And I'm not one to meddle in other people's business. Are you sure you wouldn't rather go off with your aunt? It doesn't matter. Does it? <sighs> so long as we're waiting, why don't we have a little chat, hmm? Sure, but what's there to chat about? <sighs> well, we can <laughs> talk about this island. He's trying so hard. He's trying so can hard. Can we talk about you? Ask away. I'll answer whatever I can. <laughs> Alright, what about you then? Let's hear it. So, how long have you been a captain? Uh, since well before you were born. Dang. Cool. That long, huh? <laughs> Why a captain? Was it your childhood dream? <sighs> Who can say? Didn't you ever want to be anything else? Do you have any aspirations? So. Can't say for sure. It's been quite a while since I've thought about it. Huh. But do you like being a Is captain? It normal to forget the past as you get older? Nah. You forget what you want to forget. Isn't there anything you want to hold on to? Of course there is. Your heart keeps all the really precious memories locked away. The heart remembers, huh? Right. You might think those important memories are lost. But your heart can always set a course back to them. Reminds me of Kingdom Hearts. Alright. And then the island. Tell me more about the island. No one lives here, right? Not these days. So there used to be people here. They say it was once home to a family of rich folks. But the Patriarch got sick and things went from bad to worse. Why? What happened? Uh, most of the family died. One right after the next. <sighs> How did they die? Couldn't tell you. Was it one big tragedy or a bunch of little accidents? Hold on now. I get that it can be tempting to dig into something like this. But take a lesson from me. Don't go meddling in other people's business. Even if you got to the bottom of it all, what do the dead care? I guess so, but anyway, also my curiosity. The whole thing drove what was left of them away. So now the place is deserted. Some heartless folks started calling it blood-soaked Edward Island. Oh my god. But I guess that doesn't quite roll off the tongue. Because now it's just Blood Edward Island. Blood Edward? Well, that explains that. Do you come to this island a lot? Hardly. It's rare that anyone feels the need to come out this way. Though, I did recently ferry a tall blonde man here. Blonde? Wait, really? When was this? What was his name? <laughs> Aren't we a nosy one? I mean, this could be my dad we're talking about. True, like... Sorry, miss, but that's all you're getting Why? Me. Why? I don't talk about my passengers, and I'll hold firm on okay, that. Okay, sure. Okay. 
Hmm. Isn't that your aunt? Huh? Talking to someone? Oh, yeah. Shouldn't you go? Uh, right. What is happening here? Does he know something we don't? See you later. Captain. All right, we're going. What if I want to take a picture of the captain? Hang on. I'm coming. Hang on. Bam. Picture taken. I'll remember you. <laughs> I'll remember you. That's really cool though, having a device that if someone else touches will just turn off. <laughs> I kinda like that idea. Did Jessica meet up with dad? Ugh, just the thought makes me nervous. And then she didn't come tell us? Something fishy's going on. Look, he was just sitting here waiting. Huh? Huh? He was legit just sitting here waiting for us. It still sits in the shade of a tree. Mm -hmm. What's happening here? Oh, about my, my photos. Yeah, where the fuck did they go? Did they put this on here? Looks like footprints. What, what the? the? Oh, she's Are talking. you kidding me? Don't tell me it's locked. Yep, just my luck. Why would they be doing this? Okay, well, what can I do? <gasps> He's left. He just kicked us out so he could leave. Bastard. He left. He actually left me here. Now what? <laughs> I mean, like, hello? Oh? Something under the stool? <sighs> well... Doesn't this suck? Stupid old stool. <laughs> Why am I just sitting here? I need to hurry and find Jessica. Because the duck gate's locked. Huh? Is this all some kind of test too? Like, is our dad like testing us? What's that jingling? If so, it's really shitty of our dad to do that. <gasps> Was that a bell I just heard? Kick that bitch over. <gasps> What's the oh. key doing here? Tilt the chair to get the key out. If you're playing in handheld mode, you use... Okay. Oh, I see. I don't like that. I don't like this, actually. <sighs> Hang on, let me... <clears throat>
Oh, I did it. <gasps> no! I reset it! <laughs> oh, I had it! Why is it doing this? Can you, can you just stop? Just stop. Hello? This is literally... Oh, this is the worst. Actually, the worst. I will say that. Oh my god, we did it. <laughs> Bro, okay, the controls on that was nice. very Got wonky. It. Got a key on a keychain, thank you. But what's this key for? I already know, baby girl. All right. Let's unlock the gate and find Jessica. I hope um... this key works. Bro, it better work. They obviously left that there for us to find and do this. Jessica must be up ahead. But why? Why are they like testing us? Is what I'm going with for now. Jessica. Where did Jessica go? Character screen. You can now see information about characters and their relationships in the DOS. Information in the character section will be updated as you advance through the story. Alright, well let's take a gander. Whoa! I guess we can read about them? <clears throat> Sayako. Mom died when I was three. I knew she was a scientist like Dad, but what kind of person was she really? Jessica says I have mom's eyes, but I don't remember anything about her at all. I was told that my dad died along with my mom, so if he's alive, maybe she is too. I'd love to see her again. I want to know everything about her. I guarantee she's dead. Richard. I got a letter along with a weird device from Richard Robbins, my father. But are they really from dad? I always heard he died 11 years ago with mom. Apparently the device is something dad made, and I'm the only one who can use it. Why would he send me this? I came to this Blood Edward Island he mentioned in the letter, but I don't remember anything about him or what he looks like. I wonder if he'll recognize me. Let's look at Captain. The captain of the boat that took me and Jessica to Blood Edward Island. I guess he's been doing this since before I was born, and he's really good at it. I didn't even get a little seasick. He looks a little gruff and scary, but he seems really nice when you talk to him. He told me some stuff about the island and how the people that used to live here had some trouble. What is what, what is dad doing here? Are we related to this family? Our last names are Robin. My Aunt Jessica is super nice. She raised me ever since dad dropped me at her doorstep 11 years ago. She can be strict, but I chalk that up to her being a teacher. And we do get into fights sometimes, but I know she always has her my best interest in mind. Whenever I'm feeling down, she'll hang out with me until I start feeling better. She's like a mother to me and I love her for it. I wouldn't have even come here today had she not encouraged me to. She says I should trust my dad, but that isn't easy when I can't even remember his face. Bro, for real. Ashley Mizuki Robbins. <laughs> not the English first name, uh, middle name, uh, Japanese? Was it Japanese? Of Asian descent. Tomorrow's my 14th birthday, but I feel horrible. It's all because of this package I got from my dad, who I was told died 11 years ago. All that was inside was a note telling me to come to Blood Edward Island to celebrate my birthday. And this thing that looks like a game system. I don't know what to think, it's just so random. Jessica told me I should go and I reluctantly agreed, but I have no idea why. My mind's going a mile a minute. My dad is alive, seriously? So he didn't die, he abandoned me? And now he wants to celebrate my birthday just out of the blue? Why would I possibly want to spend my birthday with him? <laughs> True though, why would I? I barely know the dude. I don't think I'll be able to even force a smile when I meet him, let alone act happy. All right, this is all we got. 
Oh, then we can go faster. We can zoom. Zoom, zoom. All right. Now we have character screen. What in the heck? It's a cart full of rocks. Are hmm. these rocks valuable? I have no idea. Bunch of people here at one point. Yeah. Wow. This cart got knocked over somehow. Did a rock fall on it and knock it over? Maybe. Warning gold mine closed, no entry. The sign's pretty faded, but I can still read it. Warning, gold mine closed, no entry. Head of her company. The gold mine. They had a gold mine going on. Even though this game's really pretty, and when you get close to some things, you can tell how blurry it is. <laughs> That's okay. Oh. Is this the mansion? Ah! Is that Jessica? Was that a scream? What kind of Scooby-Doo bullshit Jessica! is this? From the inside? Jessica! What kind of Scooby-Doo bullshit is this? Jessica got yoinked and her glasses are there? Gate is locked. No good, huh? It won't open, but I'm sure Jessica is through here. Okay. Um. Alright, we can't get through here. Okay. I was just making sure. Go over the top. Ah, a side path. Is this where we meet up with our current selves where we're at the landslide? <gasps> our our little friend. This path. Yes. I can get to the mansion. little ghostly friend that helped us <laughs> huh only Edward family members permitted past this point hello you can come out 
Alright, we continue on. We gotta go save Jessica! I wonder if we were in such a hurry. I'm so glad I can run. <laughs> oh. I can see the mansion from here. Ooh. Creepy. Not the family graveyard. Is this what I think it is? Yes. Oh. Some of them are really cracked up. It might come in handy later if you take pictures of things that catch your attention. Oh. So they're... Then why do I have a limit of 10 pictures? I want to take pictures of everyone. Batch delete overlay. Oh! We're using the camera as a... I wish we could like zoom in a little bit. Henry Edward. Nineteen ten to nineteen forty-eight when we saw that cutscene. Yeah. Nineteen forty-eight. Nineteen forty-eight. Mm. I wonder when this term was made. Chisholm's the old tombstone. Lawrence Edward, 1968 to 1948. Lawrence Edward. Huh? Hmm. There's a chunk missing from the center. What's happened to it? Thomas Edward. Same year. Mm -hmm. Whose grave is this? Thomas Edward, 1912, 1948. Thomas Edward. Hmm. Hmm. This one has a hole too. What could mm -hmm. it mean? I'm not sure what it could mean, but I guess I'll take some pictures. And I guess we'll delete them when we move on. Put the DOS away. There's an assortment of guardian tools. He, has someone been using these to take care of the grounds? Like recently? There's so what? much moss. How old is this one? Somewhat elegant. This hmm. one's pretty impressive and I can make out some words. William Wells. Was he part of the Edward family? William Wells. Uh, uh. William Wells should be... Nah, we'll remember William Wells. This grave is smaller than the others. Is a child buried here? Oh, don't tell me that. Can't get to that one, okay. Check over here. I wonder how long it's been since someone took care of this place. There are weeds and dead leaves covering everything. This grave is in rough shape and must be really old. And what's this? Locked. How does mm. it open? I don't know. We can look at our album from here. Oh, they have, um, this one has two. Hmm. 
if one stem has two... Hang on, maybe we can um, come back to this. Maybe there's more to look at. Whose grave is this? There's too much moss, I can't read what it says. The wood has rotted away. It's dark, but I think I see something in there. I think I can reach it. Just a little further? What's this? Oh. There's a rusty handle. It's no use, it won't open. Alright, so we found one. There's an old broom. I wonder how long it's been standing here. So we found a piece of it. There must be another piece on the other side. Yeah, there is. How do I get to it? Oh, it literally lets me in right here. <laughs> There's a tombstone. I can't make out what it says. There's a pair of pruning shears on the ground. They look pretty rusty. I can't use them like this. And then the piece we were missing. There's a stone fragment. Who put this here? Got sprout stone fragment. All right, thank you. Oh wait, we have to use. Sorry. Um. Oh, we still have this. Let's look at it. I should have looked at it before. I think it looks really cute. I found this inside a tool shed in the graveyard. There's a four leaf clover carved into it. I found this in front of a grave in the corner of the graveyard. There's a sprout carved into it. Let's use this one. Perfect. It fit! Oh. See, I was about to mind game this anyway. And I think I was going to be correct on how many um, clovers were on, e were on each one. It fit. Oh. Did it fit? It kind of looks like it doesn't. So we have two, four, two is what I was literally about to do anyway. So we don't need those photos. How they were placed as well. Hang on. That's what I did not remember. Two. Two sideways. Two horizontal. There we go. We figured it out. It's open. Heck yeah, we're so good at this. What? Huh? Are you kidding me? Not going anywhere with this rock in the way. <sighs> Am I gonna have to move this thing by myself? Yeah, apparently. Oh, it's a gravestone. grave? It looks different from the others. Interesting. Now what? <sighs> what? Is someone there? 
there? You. Who said that? Stop hiding! You can hear what I say? Of course I can hear you! Quit playing around! This isn't funny! I'm not playing. <laughs> he says as he's upside down. <laughs> Set on his chest. So. So. Excuse me. <laughs> what? What do you want? I just want to know your name. Uh, Ashley. Your name is uh Ashley. Uh, no. J j just Ashley. Ashley Mizuki Robbins. So I should call you Ashley. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. I don't want to die. I'm still young. Don't be afraid, Ashley. I don't mean you any harm. Please, open your eyes. Look at me. Okay. Okay. I'm opening my eyes, and I'm seeing... I'm seeing... <laughs> a ghost? A ghost. Ashley, can you... See me? Uh, yeah. You're not just saying so? I said I see you. You can see me! <laughs> oh no, now it's laughing. Why is the ghost laughing? Why is there a ghost to begin with? <laughs> I'm so freaked out right now. What's so funny? I'm laughing because I'm happy. About what? I I've been waiting so long for this. So, so long. For someone like you. Why is she special? Why can't she see a ghost? Someone like you. What do you mean, someone like me? All this time, I've been hoping for someone who could see me. Well... You've got your wish. A person who can see you. <laughs> and that's a big problem for me. I, I never wanted to meet a... a I, I mean, you're... You're totally a... A ghost? Uh, I was afraid you'd say that. <laughs> Don't be afraid. My name is... Um... It's D. Is it because we fixed his grave? D? Kind of a weird name for a ghost, isn't it? Oh, I can't believe it. I'm really talking to a ghost. What's that symbol on his chest, I bet though? this is all because I moved that rock. It probably disturbed the ghost's resting place. <laughs> Man, what am I gonna do? That's not quite right. What? That's not my grave. How is it not? My body isn't buried under that stone. It isn't? I've been here for a long time, but... No one's ever noticed me. I've been alone for so long. You've been here all alone? Yes. You're not the first to visit this spot. But none of the others ever realized I was here. Why not? I don't know. But you're finally here. The first person who can see me. That's why I know you're the one. The one? The, the one chosen who can help one. me regain my memories. Oh. Whoa. Listen, this game's about memories. What do you mean, regain your memories? Ashley, I don't remember anything about my life. Not a single thing. <gasps> Who I am. How I died. It's all a blank to me. I think that's why I'm still here. Unfinished business. Why I've been cursed to wander here for so long. How long are we talking here? Uh, 57 years. 
if I haven't lost count. You've been here for 57 years? Is it that surprising? Uh, yeah, because 57 years is old enough to be a grandpa. I suppose that's true. It's also a really long time to be alone. I can't imagine. Yeah. That's why it's so important that I regain my lost memories. I want to get back all I've lost. I can kind of sympathize about not remembering stuff, I mean. But you can't remember anything at all, D? <sighs> not even a single detail? There is something. It's not much, but it's there. Okay, what's that something? What is it? What do you remember? I remember that someone once called me D. And this mark on my chest. Uh-huh. What is that anyway? It's the last thing I ever saw. It was burnt into my mind at the moment of my death. Oh my god. Hmm. The mark is my biggest clue. If I figure out what it is, I may understand how and why I died. I have to know, Ashley. That's crazy. I need to get my memories back. Searching this island is my best chance, but I need your help. Help you? But I don't know. I mean, I don't even know if I can do anything to help. I think you can. If nothing else, you can see and hear me. I waited 57 years for that much. Please, Ashley, help me remember. I want to help him. D. What should I do? I don't want to just leave him here. I mean, he can just follow along as we're trying to but save I've Jessica. I've got my own problems. I need to find Jessica. And I've got to be back at the dock tonight for my ride home. Plus, on top of all that, I still really want to see my dad. Listen, D. I came to this island to see my dad. The same dad that Jessica's been telling me was dead all my life. Your father? Dead? I got mad at Jessica. Then she went off by herself and now I'm all alone. I should have been honest and told her I want to see my dad. Dad. Uh, yeah. What I'm trying to say is, I need to go see him. So, sorry, D. I can't help you. I just don't have time. <sighs> Father. Oh, he's remembering something. D, is something wrong? Father? <gasps> He's remembering something. Look, she's already helping him. I grew up in this house. Father. <gasps> they might have more in common than they think. You okay? I... Oh! He just left! D? Weird. Bro, he just left! Okay, I guess we won't have like a companion. Is he mad at me? But it's not my fault. I have to find Jessica. Here goes. No, he just had a memory and he had to go. He had to go. Do we have a D? Yes. D. Meeting D was one of the scariest things that's ever happened to me. He just appeared in front of me floating upside down and see-through. How could I not freak out? Apparently I'm the first person who's at... Uh, who's ever been able to see Dean, he was really happy about that. 
as happy as ghosts can get anyway. He can't really remember anything except part of his name, and I guess that's why he hasn't been able to move on to heaven or whatever. He's been alone on this island for 57 years, and that's one of the saddest things I've ever heard. I love to help him recover his memories, but I have no idea how. Are there going to be, like, chapters? It's going to be like, oh, end of chapter or something. Um, because I kind of want to know before I move on. All right, I think we'll just continue until we get to a chapter in. I don't know if it'll like be clear but or not, but we'll find out. Awesome, we made it inside. All right, I should be able to get into the mansion from here. Supposedly. So it's clear that D is um part of the Edward family. Huh? Jessica's got What's glasses. That we'll look at that in a second. Nope, it wants us to look at it now. Alright. These are Jessica's glasses. Got Jessica's glasses. That must mean Jessica made it here after all. What is this? What is this puzzle? <laughs> Another locked door. Now what? These are some intense door knockers. Ashley. <gasps> D. Do you remember? D. <sighs> so, this is where you went. What happened? You just up and disappeared. I thought you were mad at me. Mad? Why would I be mad? Because I said I couldn't help you. Oh, no. I wasn't angry. What you said helped me remember something. Remember his dad? That memory led me here. See, she is helping. So what did you remember? My father. I remembered a bit about him. It's been so long since I could remember anything at all. But then you spoke of wanting to see your dad. When I heard that, a few things suddenly came back to me. I know I was with my father when I first came to this mansion. When you first came to this mansion. Then, were you a visitor here? Like me? Where were you and your dad from originally? That... I don't know. Although... I'm starting to remember a little bit about my time at the mansion. I thought seeing the inside of it might jog my memory more. Can you open this door? I can't. I already tried. It's locked. I was hoping to get inside so I can look for Jessica. You mentioned this Jessica before. Who is she? She's my aunt. She raised me. She may be in trouble somewhere inside. Wait, aren't you a ghost? Can't you pass through walls? Nope. I can't even wiggle the door knockers. <laughs> oh, more memories. I grew up in this house. Fortunately for us, I know the secret to these door knockers. What? I just remembered what my father said about this door. He told you something about this door specifically? Yeah, I remember now. He said, I know the secret to these door knockers. Ashley. 
If you can figure out the secret, we can get inside. You want me to figure it out? Okay. Hmm. How can I open it? Okay, we need to like, um, hold on. Hey D, I know you have trouble remembering things, but does this remind you of anything? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, what am I showing him? Oh, right. Come along this way. Let's get ourselves inside. Oh. Six knocks. Oh, I see, I see, I see. The secret to these door knockers. I'm assuming we could have figured that out on our own, but maybe D helped us. Hang on, let me look around. I wanna look around this place real quick. Is there anything in here? No, it doesn't look like it. All right, so this is the secret. All right, um, let me take a picture. Wait, what'd we get? Glasses, Jessica's favorite glasses. They were on the ground in front of the mansion. Oop. They don't look broken, which is a small relief. All right, let's take a picture. I mean, I probably could remember this, but let's just do it because that's what the game wants us to do. Hmm. And then we can look at the album. Right, left, right, left, right, right, left. And then both at the same time at the end. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Was that not it? Oh. Two, three. Wait, I did it wrong. Oh no, I did it right. <laughs> I thought for sure I did it wrong. I figured it out. Well, what do you know? Thank you. I can finally get into the mansion. All right, let's go, D. Jessica's got to be somewhere inside. Dad too, I guess. Uh. Huh? What's wrong, D? Is he nervous? I've waited for this moment for so long. I can't help being nervous. <laughs> uh, pardon? Who ever heard of a nervous ghost? <laughs> I guess that is a little funny. You're the least scary ghost I've ever met. Hey, D. How about we team up? Hmm. I think I can help get your memories back. And in return, will you help me find Jessica? Yes, that's fair. Then into the mansion we go. What could scare the two of us together? Right. Can't believe I've made friends with a ghost. What a day. We're friends? Aren't we? You're right. Friends it is. Aw, they're cute. Glad to hear it. Come on, Dee. I made a friend. 
Oh, they're so cute. Stop. <laughs> Oh, yes, I would love to save. Is that the end of the chapter? Let's actually find out if it is. And if so, we'll end the episode here, but let's let's see. Oh, it is! Chapter 2, Lauren's Mansion. Okay, I ended... I, I, I exited out before it went on to chapter 2. Um, that was chapter one of Another Code. Um, I'm really enjoying it. It's more chill, more relaxed, and it's more about the journey and um, trying to figure out things. And I'm really interested in how this all comes together and what's happening with our dad. Why is he... <laughs> Surely he has some reason why he hasn't... Why he gave us away to our aunt and um, has been like in hiding, I'm assuming. I'm assuming he didn't kill our mom, but someone else did, and he had to go into hiding to protect us because he's a neuroscientist. Something must have happened. Um, but I'm excited. Also with D, that adds another layer to this game. Really excited to find out what happens, and I hope you guys are excited as I am, and I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode.